Ewan's just gone up to this first brow to try and get an, a view on what the, the deer are doing. We can hear a couple of the stags bellowing, but the last thing we want to do is both of us appear over the, the hill and they're very close, so he's just going to check and see what kind of distance they are to us. There's, um, there's quite a big stag holding about 15 or 20 hinds. Oh, really? We got them onto the snow over here. Hey. We'll actually get a very good view on good side what we're going to do from there. Great. Excellent. I'll take that. Thanks very much. And there's a stag that's obviously been pushed out. You can just see him up straight up there. Towards the screen. Yes, he's, oh. Uh, oh, yeah, but you can just see his white backside. Yeah. Usually during the last week of September, when the stags uh, break out, they start roaring. Uh, they gather the hinds together. The stags mate with the hinds at this time of year. Younger stags come in during the latter part of the rut, but I don't think they're that successful, to be honest with you. If you compare the, the way that they look at this time of year to you know, earlier in the summer, it's, they look very, very different, much more impressive. They do. Uh, at this time of year, with all the roaring that the, elder, that the older stags do, their, their necks actually swell. You see the hair sticking out from, from their chest. It makes them look bigger. That's the stag at the moment that's causing that, the hinds to run. He's actually yeah. gathering them up. I think they're circling each other at the moment, just trying to weigh up, weigh up each other. There's another young stag that's actually come in and taken most of the hinds away down beneath. It's chasing them out the hill now. <laughs> 